Cafe 22. Uh, yeah, can I put in a takeout order? Sure, what can I get for you? A double cheeseburger. Double cheeseburger. So we have half pound patties, just to let you know, do you still want it to be a double? Sure. I think I can eat two half pound patties. You got it. And then lettuce, tomato, onion, mayo, and sweet relish all good on that for you? Sounds great. Okay, and fries, pasta, potato salad. Oh, I don't care about the side. No side for you? Nope, I don't care. Okay, all right. Anything else I can get for you? No, uh, what's the total? The total is uh, 1350 Oh, what? no, I didn't have the patty. Sorry, 16 Wow. At sixteen fifty, and how long will it be? Um, probably about eight minutes or so, eight to ten minutes. Fantastic! All right, thank you very much. Aha! Uh -huh. Bye. Now that I showed you where we're at, you saw it. We're at Cafe 22, which shares a parking lot with Aspenwall's fruit stand. So I went in and I ordered the giant strawberry shake, which was $10.95. Now this is a monster, mammoth, stupid, huge shake. They grow the fruit on the land here and they get umqua ice cream delivered. So you're getting a fresh fruit shake with umqua ice cream and the fruit is grown on the farm right behind me. This is our shake. This right here. I'm putting my face next to it. I'm literally, this is a monster. I'm gonna, uh, it's, you can see it's like stuffed full it's melting, uh, a giant mountain of whipped cream on there. I have to drink a little of this down so I don't spill it, so we can go get our burger. It's hot. While I was walking back with the burger, I had to take a few tastes of this shake. Now our burger has arrived. It comes in a package like this. I like the packaging. We open it, it looks like that, which I'm okay with. And because I didn't get the side, they actually charged me a little bit less. So the burger and the shake, no side, was like 24 bucks. And this shake is a monster. It's a giant, not a large. It's clearly made with fresh fruit. You saw this guy, it was piled up high when we got it. And the burger looks like that. You got some nice half pound patties on there. Now these are half pound patties. These are larger than a lot of the burger patties we've had so far. And uh, we'll pop that open. We got some lettuce, some sauce, some tomato. There's even some cheese on the bottom. And these are big tomatoes. I mean, look at that. Look at that tomato. There's two of them on there. Big honking tomatoes. So you're talking farm fresh tomatoes here, not like I bought from Cisco or FSA. These are great fresh tomatoes. I'm hungry. It is Friday at lunchtime. It's gonna get busy. We gotta record. Let's get to eating.
Now remember, for the series, we always, 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 always wash down our burger with some shake. So my first impression, it, I love the shake. The shake is delicious. It is thick. It is super thick. There's so much strawberry in there that look at that. I even pulled some out when I just tried to pull out the spoon, the straw, to show you that it's like a Slurpee straw. I took a fresh strawberry chunk out on camera to show you that. The shake is fantastic. The shake by far is my favorite part of this meal. The burger, eh, when you compare it to the shake, it's really not doing so good. The price point is only a few dollars more than the shake. Now the ground beef patties, there is a lot of meat, but I feel the quality of the meat might be a little less than what I'd like. Probably why the price point is so low. Um, the cheese, I think it's American cheese probably. Melts like it, kind of tastes like it. And uh, the fresh veggies definitely are the best part of this burger. I love fresh veggies on a burger. I love good quality ground beef. The mayo in the bun, not bad either. So I'm okay with this. We have to give this guy his encore performance. <laughs> now remember, for the series, we always, always, always wash down burger with a shake. Every single time. So now after the encore performance, I got to reevaluate the burger. It wasn't as it wasn't as bad as I initially had thought. Maybe I got a couple bad bites. I don't know whatever it is, but the encore performance it did fare a little bit better. But out here in this nothing, it beats this shake. This shake is the MVP for the season, the game MVP, the Super Bowl MVP, the Grand Slam winner. This game, this shake is like the reason you come out here. It is fantastic. This giant shake was like 11 bucks. It is a monster. The price point for the burger and the shake combo is pretty comparable to the ones we've had but the burger but the shake is a lot bigger and this is the best quality shake i've had this is my favorite shake out of everywhere we've been so far in the series and it's not even close i would come out here just for the shake and the countless other desserts they have here this is the reason you come this is the reason you come out here this is the reason you cross that terrible traffic to come here to Aspen Walls and Cafe 22. All right, so now we got to put them on the chart. And after drinking a bunch of shake, it, this was a tough decision. I kind of had to think about it a little bit extra. The shake is phenomenal. If we're just comparing shakes, the shake is probably the best one in the series i love fresh fruit shakes so it's probably i'm probably not going to find better than that the burger is not on par with the shake the burger is probably slightly below average in our series so when you put a slightly below average burger with a a plus 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 valedictorian shake where do they land as a combo in comparison to everything else? And where they land for me is right there, right below breakfast and burgers. I had to think about it. I really like the shake. I really dig on the shake, the burger, not really so much together as a combo because that's what they're doing. Where do they land? And they land right there right below breakfast and burgers so i'm going to put links to the other videos in this series in the description box below check them out don't forget to give the video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and i thank you for watching